The truth is out there, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, UFOs are real, apparently. The Pentagon has announced that they're real. And um, guess what? No one seems to give a shit. Unbelievably, you know, basically we've been, this has been called full disclosure, essentially. It's something people who are interested in UFOs have wanted to talk about for a long time. And we're going to talk about that tonight on a report for Toga Mountain and what it could mean. Is this the next PSYOP the government are planning? UFOs? Let's talk about it tonight on the report from Toga Mountain. Yes, little green men and UFOs, they're here, ladies and gentlemen. Apparently, the Pentagon and various other government agencies, including NASA, have revealed footage of, um, you know, things that they've seen that they can't identify. And, you know, there's a lot more talk about the... Uh you know, um, the fact that UFOs are real, you know, I mean, obviously many, many of us on the, in the conspiracy community or have been long fascinated by the topic of UFOs have long known that UFOs are real um, to some extent. But, you know, to what extent that is, we, we've never really fully known, of course. And the government has always kept this agenda kind of secret. And, um, you know, you've got to ask yourself, like, what, why at this particular moment when they're kind of bringing in this kind of, you know, obviously they're bringing in the kind of New World Order stuff in the totalitarianism with the, the COVID agenda, then you've got all the oppressiveness, economic oppressiveness of the climate change lie. And then you've got this new thing where they're, they're beginning to talk about, I mean, there's long been a rumour in the conspiracy community that the next big site will be essentially a fake invasion of Earth using basically uh, either, you know, footage that will either be doctored using either deep fakes or CGI, or they'll actually have alien technology that they've worked out how to use, you know. And um, so this is a very interesting um, situation at the moment. I mean, what are they going to do with this kind of alien agenda? Now, I mean, first of all, you've got to ask, is it really aliens behind it? I mean, or have we just found the alien technology and learned how to use it after, say, 50 years since Roswell or something like that? My bet is... Aliens are definitely real. My bet is that they visited Earth and that they may have played a role in um, human development and evolution along the lines of, say, a film like Prometheus, where aliens have kind of, like, turned up every now and then and maybe, you know, and also a bit like 2001 A Space Odyssey, what that film was saying, is kind of like, you know, giving us the next push along the evolutionary ladder. I do believe aliens have probably had some kind of involvement with humanity like that. But I don't know, are they regularly flying in and out? I, I really don't know. And uh, what we're seeing when we see UFOs, just kind of... Um, you know, like, uh, for example, technology from the US military or from um, Chinese or Russian military that we you know, don't know exists, or is it alien technology that we're working out how to use? So I think that's where we're you know, more going to be at. And let me tell you, I'm going to give a prediction. If we do have some kind of alien agenda, it's going to be like this. They're going to, the aliens are going to turn up and I don't know where they'll appear. Maybe they'll deliver an ultimatum or some kind of message to humanity. And it will be very much along the lines of um, the Great Reset, which is like, oh, give, all the, give all the power and money to the people in Davos. They are enlightened uh, rulers over Earth. And, um, you know, like Klaus Schwab, what a nice guy he is. And Bill Gates, he's fantastic. And, you know, it'll be that kind of message that these are the great kind of rulers and that, you know, some kind of planetary government um, is really necessary for humanity. And the aliens will probably warn us with, look, you better do it. You better give all the power to these people or else we're going to, you know, get our alien death ray or, a, you know, Martian stun gun, you know, and zap everybody. So that, I think, is how the elite could use the alien agenda. They could essentially create a kind of psyop. I don't know whether it would be, uh, I don't know how they would do it, whether it would be a kind of first context situation like, um, say, in Close Encounters of the Third Kind or something like that. But I do believe it would be false. And, uh, and obviously the message of the aliens um, would... Pr if it's a globalist one, it's bullshit. If it's something completely different, if it's something like... I don't know. I mean, if it really is a message from the aliens, it'd be something I certainly probably won't better guess. So um, obviously you probably will better tell whether the message is fake or not by, by, by what it is. But if it's certainly um, supporting the uh, kind of agenda of Davos and the agenda of people like Klaus Schwab and Bill Gates and all these globals like Soros, I would say it's fake, ladies and gentlemen. Um, but if it's something completely different and off the wall, maybe it's real. So we have to keep it interesting, uh, keep both our eyes open, maybe even our third eye, and, um, you know, await the aliens uh, and, and who will obviously demand to take us to your leader. And uh, at the moment, that's Joe Biden. That's not very advisable, you know, because the aliens will think, what the hell is going on here? So that's the report from Tiger Mountain for today. UFOs are real, but what is their agenda and what's it going to be about? We don't know. Thank you for listening.